Well, so let's just go off the premise of you made the statement to me. I I guess this could be where like it starts. Where the yeah here starts. yeah explain explain the situation, Kai. Okay, uh, okay. All, everyone out there, this is this is to all you hell divers guys. Also, like, thank you so much for the support. Hell divers alert! <laughs> Ring the hell divers alarm. You guys, hell divers. You guys went a little crazy on that last video, and we really appreciate it. To anyone who commented or liked or even just stopped by for a second, um, but yeah, thanks. What, what, what's that, going like, on here? seriously, <laughs> awesome. Okay, so we were we, of course, as anyone would do, we were kind of popping off a little, just feeling like holy crap, like, what? This is amazing. The, we've never had this kind of success before, right? So it, it just is, like, incredible to us. And then Logan, as we're talking about it, made the <laughs> statement that the Helldivers community is kind of scary. Uh, and, <laughs> dude, those are, I heard some buzzwords right there. I had some buzzing in the brain, like, yeah, ooh, like content? I... Yeah, so, so yeah, I, I, expound, expound. I wanted to talk about it a little bit because it is a little intimidating because it's kind of crazy to just make a like a one off little Helldivers video and be like, hey, you know, I don't know if I'm going to like this game. Here are some concerns I have. I would like to learn more about it. You know, I didn't feel like I was being very uh, not, not that not that anyone was like calling me out for being like annoying or anything, but like so many comments are like play the game, play the game, play the game. You know, it's, it's, it's incredible how dedicated these fans are. And it, it, I think it's a great thing, right? Like if you're part of this community, you probably feel like, so like validated and feel like you have comrades everywhere, right? All of these people are joining together to fight this force. You know what I mean? Like that's what the game's all about, but it's, it's just crazy how like this community just, we're still getting comments on that video today being like, Join us. Play the game. It's not too late. Play the game. You know, which is like, it's just kind of nuts. So it it is a little intimidating, right? I'm like, this is kind of scary to want to hop into that community because I don't know if I'm that gung ho. You know, I don't like. Oh, you will be. But I and I do have to say this too that I made it very clear in the video that like I already want to play this game. It's already on my list. If you watch our meter video, which came out. Uh, not too long ago, the I talk about how I have these meters that fill up, and when they fill up, I I like I do whatever the meter is, or I mean it, it's something like that. So it's like the Hell Divers two meter has been filling up for a long time, and when I I only watched maybe five seconds of gameplay and already decided I wanted to play the game, right? So it's not like I need to watch the trailer to be I don't know I don't need to be convinced. It's 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 a less about do I want to play it. And more about like when's the right time, because you know I have friends that I like to play games with on the weekends, and so I'm like, when do they want to play? Can they afford it right now? Could should I buy it? Can I afford it right now? Like, and do I have the time? Because I'm already like spreading myself so thin on so many other things, like this podcast and like you know my job and other responsibilities, you know. Um, so it's, it's more about what wins the time and not whether or not I actually want to play it, um, which is just kind of funny, mm -hmm. but, um, yeah. What do you think? Kai? Do you think, do you think they're scary? Uh, no, I think partially be, it helps that I'm part of that community. So like, right. I know how it goes <laughs> yeah. as strong as people are coming off. That's honestly, to me, one of the biggest selling points of the game it has i have not felt this passionate for a game in a long long time and i'm sure everyone who commented can agree like there's there's video after video after video that are surfacing just talking about this is new this is fresh this is incredible i've never felt this way before this is new it's just yes. all over the place yes. so i i kind of am of the feeling that it's like it, that gung ho -ness is the big selling point of the community there are always going to be like bad apples in the community it's well, that's sure just happens, yeah right? and i'm not i'm not here to like call anybody out i i think it's honestly awesome even though you think passionate. they're scaly well it's 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 not that like it's not scary in like a 
bad way necessarily. It's almost like shocking. I guess it, maybe that's a better way to put it. Like mm. I'm, I'm taken aback to see a community like that is this rallied together over something. Um, like I don't, I don't, you don't see it very often. And the fact that the game, the game came yeah. out two months ago. Okay. And I feel like it's just going to continue to grow, which is also not something you see these days. These days, usually you see a game come out and it explodes and then it kind of falls off in popularity. Like we saw it with lethal company. We've seen it with, you know, all other sorts of indie games, you know, like they'll come out, like everyone's talking about, it, everyone's playing it for like two to maybe six months. And then it just kind of dies down, which I know that we're still in the early stages of hell divers, but I feel like in a year, I don't know if it's going to be old news. I feel like if, as long as the game keeps growing and evolving, it's going to stay current, um, which is, that's really cool. And I, I, I mean, to all you people listening and wondering and saying, I need to buy, I need to play it. I will most likely play this game this summer. Dude, what? At, at the very <laughs> oh, okay, latest. This summer. I am, I am announcing Sorry. it. It might even be sooner. Okay. It might even be sooner. So I, I guess I'll keep this up. I'll keep updating throughout this podcast. I'll keep updating people on where I'm at with Helldivers if, if, if things progress. Um, but as of right now, it's looking good. Okay. The meter's filling up the, the timing, the stars are starting to align a little bit. Um, I just need to make sure that, you know, I have a bunch of other games on my plate. I have a bunch of other responsibilities and things I need to make sure I take care of. And, uh, cause I really want to dive into it when I do, I don't want to just like play this game for like a weekend and then not touch it for six months. You know, it's like, I want to actually like be a part of the team, you know, like that's what I want. Dude, it's time. I, it sounds like it's time. <laughs> not, not There's quite. no better time it's than now. Almost time. It's almost time. Um, I feel like it's still going to be a few weeks. Uh, but it's Dang, looking dude. good. Do you want a Helldivers update? A breaking news update? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Keep me current on it so when I hop in, I know what's going on. Okay. Here's some breaking news. I need that. Didn't we decide on a... I guess we never like found one, but we do need a jingle, like a. I don't oh, know. Yeah, I like would do trumpet. it with my face, but yeah. yeah. I don't know if I added that to the last one. Uh, <laughs> oh no! Uh, I'll you didn't one. manage your democracy. Okay, <laughs> we're breaking Helldivers news. This is the newest thing that's happening. Okay, so you know how we've been fighting the bots, and there was this huge invasion yes. force, right? The, the atomic. It's just. Freaking crazy. Yeah, the yes. automatons. Uh -huh. Um just nuts, dude. It was like every single level is the most dangerous thing you could put your eyes on. It's just freaking crazy. Wow. There's yeah. explosions everywhere. Uh we managed to push the bots back a little bit. So there's a brand new order that came in this morning. And I logged in this morning, and our order is to kill one, no, not not one, but two billion. Bugs. Billion? Two billion bugs. How many players are there? How many, what's the player base? Active player base. Oh, I don't know. That's uh, not two billion. That's <laughs> two billion would be like 25% oh, well, of the human population. Hold on. Let, let me see if I can do some math here. Okay. Helldivers 2. Active player count. Okay. And I guess we're just going off Steam here. Um, right now, there's 152,000. Like as of right this this recording okay um it says that all time two months ago was four hundred and fifty thousand. so we are on the on the downward slope it looks like right now um but let's see if 152 thousand people killed five bugs each that's still like not even a million that's like seventy hundred and sixty thousand. Yeah, that's that's so, still. So you said how many? Two billion. Two billion bugs. Divided by one hundred and fifty. So each player. You can't even count kill... that on your hands, if guys. Every player you can't killed... even count it on your hands. <laughs> Maybe I mean you don't know. Some people have big hands. Well, <laughs> I don't know if how the <laughs> size of your hands changes. <laughs> Um, so each, to two billion. each player would have to kill 13,000 bugs. So every player Dude, that's, that's playing this down. week. 13,000, which how many do you kill in a mission, usually? 
Well, so for reference, I I played some bug this morning. So I'm a morning kind of hell diver. <laughs> You're a morning I, diver. I I eat bugs for breakfast. Um Dude, so sounds, when I did it this morning, sound good. Am I crazy? That sounds good right now. Maybe I'm just weird. No, right gosh, no. Heck, <laughs> I would never actually watch, consume uh, a bug. Timon and Pumbaa, where they like lift the rock and they like eat the bugs. Yeah, but that's still disgusting. I mean, they made it. Look I know it's colorful good. and vibrant, okay, okay. but what like, about, what about Pacha when he slurps the bug with the straw? That's even worse. Okay, I can't right. think of mm. a single time that there's like a cartoon <laughs> bug. <laughs> does something okay okay oh let's, wow let, let's move on from the from the breakfast. okay here's here's a testament to the the power of the hell divers uh i just i'm looking at the the major order now two billion bugs right that came yes. out this morning yes it's over we did it oh wait no way for real we we yeah i just logged in we killed two two billion no bugs well, in one day. Say, so how many how many bugs do you kill in a mission on average? You know. Oh, uh, the mission that I did. So when I play alone, I usually play on the medium difficulty, just because I am often kind of doing other things sure. while I do hell yeah, divers. I'm, I'm not here to judge your uh, whatever kind of difficulty you want. That's fine. I I occasionally go on challenging, but sometimes they they just overwhelm me as one player, sure. and I'm like not the best hell diver. I'm just a hell diver. Hey, no, it, but, it's all it all counts. Okay, I'm not again. I'm not here to judge. I uh, yeah. Well, so in that medium mission, I killed I think it was like 560 bugs. Okay. See uh, again. Like I'm not I'm not doing this to like be like oh Kai only killed. No. So um with my math. It means that means that for you to kill your average quota for two billion, you would need to do about twenty three or twenty four missions. So I was just wow doing dang. some math. So I would like to submit a formal apology for my current <laughs> hell diver. He is not pulling his weight. I will be playing from dusk to dawn to dusk no, again. You, wait, no, you're fine. It, the grind will never it, cease. Not not all divers are created equal. <laughs> I feel like some people might... Some divers are more equal than others. Well, and who knows? If you play with a squad, maybe there's more enemies. Maybe... Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, and like um, if you... Uh, playing on medium is child's play, honestly. I could do challenging if I wanted to. I'm just kind of... Right, crazy. right. And then like, you know, difficulties can change how much and then whatever. Like some people might... Be able to play this game full time because they're streaming it or whatever it is so it's like it evens yeah out. it evens out um but i was just saying on average it, it, it would take about 20 missions so that's kind of interesting um i just want to throw that out there. okay you know okay so this is something i will say that does i wouldn't say slightly scare me but it is kind of like like you said stunning yes. is the sheer uh i okay so and in the game, there's managed democracy. You're fighting for super earth and things like that. Yeah. I'm going to, I'm going to be the, the possible traitor for a second. Oh man. He's and I know, he's I know it's a running joke. He's turning, I'm not turning. Right, well, hold on. on. Hold on. Force. I'm just using my critical What's thinking happening? cap. So Helldivers 2 definitely has like one of its big selling points is camaraderie is joining the cause and stuff like that. Yeah. And this definitely takes on like a Starship Troopers kind of... Right. Almost, uh, it's satire, almost, of what you're fighting for. And my worry is that some people might not take it very much as satire. And they'll attach too much mm. of this fictional world to their their real identity. That's something that kind of worries me, just because... Yeah. Do you think they're going to get too People lost could do that. in the Liberty sauce? Is that what you're saying? Maybe, maybe. I, I can't, <laughs> I, I can't say I've like specifically met just, someone I'm like that. I'm just imagining people who are like, they're just like in the room, like freedom, Liberty. I, I need to get back freedom, to the grind. Yeah. You know, <laughs> or, our, our, our galaxy's ruined. I mean, I kind of know what you mean. I feel like the, the, the middle ground is where, where most people are, where it's like, uh, you know, anytime you really bring it up and get serious about it, everyone will say, Oh yeah, we, we know that like super earth is just as in the wrong as the bots. Right, the but it's, it's like if you, if you do space camp or if you do D and D or something where like when you're in it though, it's like, it's just super fun to be 
in that role and to right you know but, share that experience with other people but like you know some people do get really immersed into those things but like i if that's me, exactly I, what i'm saying i'm definitely me, always on that side of like you know i i know that this isn't real but i'm also like super down to like play the role and be immersed right you know? my my worry is that these people could cause like real damage <laughs> to the community in that in that they take it way too far they take the bit and and travel way too far with it i've had this happen in like some improv games of people taking a bit way too far and it's just it just is mm, yeah kind Where's of concerning the there because i am interested like i think you're right but i don't know what that looks like because like you know the, the people who commented on the last video like the, the, nobody was doing that you know from from my knowledge. yeah so it's seriously like, yeah so it's like i i know i think you're right but i also am like what would that even look like <laughs> like I, I it it is interesting, dude. I honestly don't know, but I mean, like, it goes to things where in the game, you know, if I goof around with my brothers, and I'll be like, "Do you ever think that the bugs are actually not the the bad guys?" And they're kind of, and <laughs> I can't even finish my thought before oh, someone rockets me in the face, and they're like, "That that was two traitors. We well, can't so have that." <laughs> Dude, that's some, <laughs> dude, I've been watching Attack on Titan recently. That's some Attack on Titan stuff right there. So like, yeah, exactly. Like, holy, exactly. Dude. Um, yeah, uh, yeah. That's that's funny, dude. So you know, all in all, yeah, I think it's it can be scary when any community is dedicated, and this this community is it, on the surface. It even like it feels like these people will will die for this game. You know um uh, which i think is great i, I just hope no I, one I actually dies thing. for this game yeah well let's yeah. figuratively sure yeah. but i really hope that no one actually sure tries to hurt themselves or others in the name of managed democracy like that's <laughs> what that'd be a news story and a half for sure but yeah i, I really, that really would i really hope everybody's playing safe out there you know um like i hope i don't get flack for for actually wanting to be a responsible human um but <laughs> Dang, you, that's some serious shade thrown at are you referencing the entire hell divers community no <laughs> no maybe i don't know you uh, heard it here logan just designated the entire hell divers community as irresponsible maybe, adults maybe i'm the scary one okay maybe Ooh. that's Maybe, Maybe you are the real traitor because you're not joining the cause. Or, hey, or if, well, if in a I, more... If I was a bug, would they let me join? The Hell Divers? Yeah. No. Even Heck if I was no. like, even if I was like a good bug who like wanted to like fight against the cause. He... Okay. Uh, well, Maybe we're getting that's too kind of an interesting here. thought. <laughs> maybe are we getting we, lost in the hell diver sauce? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe, maybe bugs deserve to die. You know, I actually said maybe that in, a, in the is in the cryptid one. I, I in one of our episodes, I actually talked about how bugs <laughs> deserve to die. So. Oh yeah, maybe, the mosquitoes thing. Yeah. I've I've, ma I've been meant to be a hell diver this whole time. I think that's maybe. The reality. But. But yeah, that that's all I have to say on this. Um, and uh, thanks again for everybody who enjoys this content and who supports this. If you want us to talk about something on our show here on YouTube, here on Spotify, like put it down in the comments and like, I would love to get some suggestions or if you even want any, if you have any questions that you want us to answer, it could be stupid. It could be serious, whatever you want. Um, exactly. Yeah. Uh, also, also as another question specifically for my fellow hell divers, what's your personal favorite stratagem to use? Um, I'm gonna get a whole lot of freaking flack for this because there <laughs> there is a meta, right? But I personally love the jump pack. It's one of my favorite things. It's it, it doesn't really shield you in any way, but I just love the jump pack. The versatility it gives you going around the map, being able to um, kind of get to places that no one, none of the other things can necessarily can you. It feels very versatile in its uses. I yeah. granted, I know it's not good at higher difficulties, but I'm a I'm a jump pack stand. Let us know what your best <laughs> stratagem is, and feel free to hammer me in the comments. I can take it. Yeah, my <laughs> my hell diver body can take it. Oh man, um, I, I yeah. If you have any noob strategies, I'll put them down there too, because I don't know what anything is. So. You know, when I play the game, I'll I'll go to the comments and I'll do whatever you guys say is the best. So, 
we should totally do a video <laughs> where you can only you you have to skip the tutorial and oh all gosh. you have to work with to learn Are how to comments? play is the comment oh section gosh, that would be dude. actually really funny <laughs> i'm like reading a comment it's like okay so you got to spin around four times and you gotta you yeah gotta, you gotta <laughs> jump and shoot, shoot the shoot the air and once you do that then you can start killing the bugs but make sure you shoot yeah, exactly only, only in the legs if you shoot them in the body it's like not good but in like only melee damage or something it's like people are just gonna go wild with it uh, but yeah maybe maybe i will put it down in the comments i I'll, I'm, I'm dumb for whatever honestly in the meantime we got some some uh stay tuned for our uh creeping pastas we're, we're gonna talk about creepy pastas next so stay tuned for that thank you guys so much for watching we really do appreciate it and till next time bye